How's it going, everybody? Welcome back yet again into our beautiful single-player city. That's it's it's growing pretty quick. It's going pretty good. It's it's getting larger by the day. And today, it might not grow outwards as much, but we are going to be adding in so many little details. I'm actually very very excited for hopefully what this place is going to turn out like even just after this episode today. So I hope you guys are ready. We're building a bridge, and it's going to be a bridge that's very different to your average sort of bridge. So, generally, when we build a bridge, for instance, we've just walked over one. This one is straightforward. We go from one block on this side to another block on that side that are both in the same line. I know you guys have done it before. We've all done it right around here. So, if we go here, look at this block, straight line, you get the picture. That's how we do bridges generally. Generally. Why am I already messing up my, my words? Generary. Why did I say that? Generally. Come on, Jancy. Come on, you've got a whole episode to go through and you're messing up already. Ah, oh, dang. Dang it. We'll see how we go. Okay, good luck. Here we go. Let's get started. So, this is the bridge. And as I was saying, we've got a straight line over there. This one's gonna have two differences. Instead of starting at one point and finishing at another point with a slight curve, but trying to play with the eye to go straight, we're actually gonna make this also curve in it, like what we were sorting out in the last episode. Do you guys remember? If you didn't remember the last episode, you probably want to go check it out. We've we built a pretty good looking tunnel, if I don't say so, well, if I do say so myself. Yeah, this is gonna be a long day. Alright, so what we've got is we've got this cool little curve over here, and I want to change it up a little bit. I've I've gone ahead, extended the water over underneath here, and I'm still deciding where it goes after that. Do we pull it up that way? Do we split it off in two directions? There's quite a few things to think about, and and a, a lot of it is to kind of get the idea of where the origin of this water is, where it comes from. So that, that's a, a future project, much, much further in the future. So let's go ahead and think about this. So I want a bridge that comes over here to this side around on the other end of this. Actually, I'll just... Oh, dang it, that was, that was a bit silly of me. I, I hit my elytra too early, and I just kind of dived. So that's the thing, we want this to have a, a solid support on this side where we're going to have a little bit of a wooden bridge over the other side and I'm going to go ahead and do something which I've tried every time. I tried it in the last episode and I just, I need to give this block a little bit of love. The the good old jungle wood planks. Ah, oh, spider and our friends. Actually, I'm going to get annoyed by the noise from the spider. So I'm just going to get rid of it now, Then we then we don't have to deal with it a bit later. So let's go around this side. In fact, I could probably just end a pearl up. That's probably the easiest way to do this. There we go. There we go. Perfect. And here is what I was thinking. So we want to have ourselves a bridge. We're going to change this over from this floor, this the stone over here. But we want ourselves a bridge that's going to give us a bit of color. It's also going to give us a little bit of, of an interest to this area. Because really, these, these roads and stuff, generally, I find generally people do streets and do roads in the world. And then they kind of just become a street and a road, and that's it. Then everything else happens. The buildings are what makes it interesting. But I think as soon as you start doing bridges, as soon as you start doing tunnels, things like that, that's where you can start adding in detail in some of the more forgotten points of the of the world. And in fact, almost do even more with those points than what you normally would. I think, I, I think personally, that that's got way, way, way more, like, life in it, I guess, is, is the word. Okay, that's not the way you do it. That is the way you do it. I actually want to go to there, I think, like that. We'll just fill this in here and probably get rid of that. There we go. So we're just trying to get a good looking bridge that goes up a little bit and down the other side. Uh, because, of course, I don't think we're going to be able to texture this up, at least with the, with the jungle. So it'll be all right. And also just getting a bit of a different color in. If, if we can work it in, I'm, I will be very, very impressed with, uh, with <laughs> working in the jungle wood. Actually, let's just check it from the bottom here. Yeah, that's good. Prepare yourselves. It's, it's going to change a lot from what, what I've got here, hopefully. I've got a pretty cool idea, I think, for this bridge. Simple, but uh, but complex at the same time. You know how it is. So, there we go. And I guess this is the part where I just go down and, and clear out some stuff over here. So, let's just do this. Okay, that's fine. There we go. And we just have to get rid of all this stone. And I actually recently got rid of my beacon from this area to go work over on the mountain during streams and, and that's been <laughs> if you guys don't know the mountain there's 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 definitely a mountain in this world it's huge and and i've been working on that during streams but cutting down the trees underneath it has been why i needed the beacon of course uh yeah we've only got one beacon right now so i i don't have the luxury of being able to break this a little bit quicker but in fact it's not that much i thought this would take way longer than it has 
that's something I need to go and fix over there. Just put that down. Remember it. And then, of course, the sun's going down as well, which is something we're going to have to deal with. Okay, I've actually missed a lot of these. I guess I couldn't tell from the top, though. That's, that's fair enough. So we'll get rid of that there, that there, and what we'll do is we'll quickly go and take a bit of a rest. Looking good. So what I've done is I've just gone ahead, cleared that up, cleared up this and re-put it back down because we're going to be working down underneath here. And not only that, we've also fixed up a little bit of the bridge just to, to smooth it out a little bit. It's not really a big deal, but I thought it was worth mentioning in case someone was was watching, trying to get some stuff from that. It's it's not really a big deal. By the way, I actually have this blue concrete, uh, not powder, that's just normal concrete. Uh, I was going to mark out where I want this river to continue, but I don't think we're actually going to do that. So let's go and grab ourselves some of these. And this is what I'm thinking. Uh, actually, I should probably I should probably be out there to show you that. So right around here, what I'm thinking is that's got a pretty cool curve. And in fact, I can show you from the top how cool that curve is. We'll do that and we'll use this as the time, but underneath here, it needs some cooler curve as well. There we go. And uh, I think I can jump that, can't I? Could probably, okay, I could just do this here, easy. So around here, look at that. That's the curve that I'm talking about. Really, really neat. I, I actually quite like that. It just goes nice smoothly around there. We're gonna have an entrance up here, probably some stairs going up here, connecting these two platforms. And by the way, this is gonna be a bunch of townhouses around there. Where's the sun? The sun's actually, yeah, it's, it's going closer, closer down. So that's the plan at least, just so, so you guys get some perspective on it because a bit of perspective on this place does help. It goes a very long way. Oh, yeah, just missed that one. There we go. All right, so here is what I was what I was thinking in terms of getting this place underneath here to look a little bit more interesting. So we'll just start off by doing this on, okay, that, that'll work, whatever, that'll, that'll be fine. I'm just placing blocks kind of, Kind of randomly with the way I'm doing it. Ordered, but random at the same time. And what we're trying to do is we're trying to get this to have a, a neat little curve going up to the middle. And I understand that at some stage, we should probably not be able to place blocks without them having a gap because of purely this over here being the uh, being in the way. So there is probably our, our limit. Yeah. So we'll go up to where we can do that. So there we can't. And we'll try and hide what we can't show over there with the side pieces of this. So let's just make sure this is working. Hold up. There we go. And yeah, like that. So that over there gives us a nice little curve underneath the bridge. Very easy curve. Very, very simple curve. But basically it gives you a super easy curve under the bridge. Goes down that way. And it's going to give us a nice shape, hopefully, by the end of this. Of course... These are just theories, just little hunches, so I'm not too sure if it's actually going to be the case. In fact, do we have enough? I think that's all we have all the way here, so I might have to go and make a trip all the way to the other side of the world just to get a bit of spruce. That's a, that's a, a pity. Although I do use a lot of spruce, so you know what? I'm, I'm down to do that every now and then. It's just, it's just, I feel like, I feel like I've gone through so much wood recently. It's ridiculous. That's all right. It means we've been building some good stuff, hopefully. So there's, there is some, there's some light at the end of the tunnel there. So how about there? A little bit of something. Make this over here a bit more interesting, I guess. There, there. Yeah, there, there's the, there's where it, we've got our limit at least. So like that. I'll, I'll work on the other side there a bit later. Let's, let's just make sure this is working. Oh, what am I stuck in? I'm stuck in a, a is that a spruce leaf? I'll get out of here. There we go. <laughs> I could have just sent a pearl there, but that's all right. Yeah, that's workable because now what we're going to do is we're going to put the edge piece on here. And I think what will happen there is we'll do a nice little railing, which is what I'm calling the edge piece. We'll do the railing and we'll have some stuff hanging off the sides of it. That will allow us to really get this place to hide this piece over here. So probably get started. Oh, and what I was thinking is right around here. Okay, that's all I got there. That's right. Probably should be smart about this, just in case. Because my luck is, I'm going to leave these to despawn and fall one short. And then just be be annoyed that I, did, <laughs> I didn't just go ahead and, and pick them up as I was doing stuff. So there we go. Alright, let's move up one more, like that. I mean, how often do you do that? Where you, where you, you think, oh yeah, I'll leave those to despawn. And then that exact same project, you need them. So, yeah. Lesson learnt. Not all the time, but lesson learned. Actually, this is probably best off to go this way. If I'm if I'm doing what I'm doing, I think doing that that way and that one that way will we'll hide this quite nicely. And then probably one in... 
Actually, that could probably be a, a full... A full block, the way this is. So I'm really just trying to cover this edge piece. Full. Ah, oh, there. Okay, that's cool. So let's just make sure that is working. Edge piece. Yeah, that's doing good. You see, this is where some of the building... I mean, there's so many different things, but sometimes your your most important thing in building is just hiding stuff. You put things down, and then you you build your whole build about hiding things of your build. And... Oh, I can hear some zombies. Uh, actually, I hope that... That, that actually could be a bit of a problem in this house down to the other side here. Uh, they might they might actually very well take some doors out if there is a zombie in there. But hey, that's all right. Doors aren't the biggest problem. We do have a door lose uh, like a door theft problem in this <laughs> in this city. But you know what? That's all right. We can we can keep replacing the doors or or just while we replace them. I guess we we really fix them because there's a better way of placing doors. So that over there, I'm good with that. Yeah, that that's definitely gonna work. We'll probably just want to place that up there. Good pearl. And then maybe... Oh no, I need that. And maybe something over here. I think these might be a bit too much, but... I'll go ahead and give, a, give it a go. And we'll check how that finishes off that side. Yeah, that works. I think we just need something there. In fact, maybe we could put some anchor points on that, that somewhere, like... Uh, uh, we'll, we'll do these for now. And do I have, I've got more ender pearls. Thank goodness. I had the feeling I was going to be pearling around a lot. So maybe if we go like one, two, and then we do this one here as a separate block. And then we'll go again like one, two, and then maybe do this one around here as a separate block. Perhaps. Like that. Let's just... The, the, the thing is, because this is at that angle that I was telling you about, it may very well need to change around a bit. But no, that, that seems alright. That seems good. So we've got the, them in each place. That's going to be like a, a reference just for us in general. I didn't realize that my idea would probably fail. In fact, you know what I could do is I could just pull this right across there. That's it, that's the worst case scenario, so that's not a big deal. Uh, and also, I want to go ahead. Let's just run around, run a round back into the, the storage room, which is now looking pretty fine. And that is to get a block of color to add a little bit of life into that area. In fact, two things with color. First thing, banners, because banners are amazing. Second thing is, I think, the blue concrete. Not in there. Oh, no, blue terracotta. That's it. And there. Beautiful. So this is what we needed. I always find I end up bunny rabbiting around the most. In fact, how many jumps have I got in this? Let's just let's just find the the cool statistic of the day. There's a jump. There we go. 846,574 jumps. You can add probably another 10 by now. <laughs> Almost 1 million jumps have been done in this world. How crazy is that? I knew that number would be something stupid. There, there you have it. A stupidly huge number. 1 million jumps. There's so many big numbers after one year. I'd love to know a global Minecraft statistic for myself, or even just everyone in general, but just a global one for myself would be crazy. Over, over the whole time I've been playing this game in this world, over, over like, the, for instance, even just playing on, like, a server, a Hypixel server or something. Although, I guess if you are playing, if you are playing on, on different controlled worlds with different things, I guess, I guess the, the settings really could make certain things go higher. But still, it'd be a cool number to know. The number's not important, it's just, it's just interesting. Yeah. Okay, that, that'll that'll do the trick. So what I think we'll do is we'll put this as an anchor point because I've got a plan to hide these. Trust me, trust me. I know, I know many of you have doubt. Do not have doubt. I, I, I got this. 100%. So what we'll do is we'll put one of those there, one of those there. Use them as a good place to hold on to this. And then... Yeah, okay, we'll do this. I really don't want to do Dark Oak. We may very well change it, but... I don't think I've got enough just at the moment to be able to switch this over. In fact, yeah, I'll, I'll do this over here like that and that there. And then around here, we'll probably just, in fact, maybe just go something like this and put these in here like this. I've actually been thinking about this a little bit. Th this little idea of, of doing <laughs> something like that for a while. I think it, it, it makes things a little bit more interesting. Can I just do that? No. I should have known that. Come on. There we go. 
Yeah, okay, so I've successfully made you guys lose faith in me, don't worry. I've got a few things to grab before we, we come back and do more of this. Alright, so there we go, this is where I'll win it all back. I'll win you guys' hearts back with with hopefully <laughs> hopefully a bit of pressure right now is going to get something good looking here. Alright, so let's get started. Jump up here, get one of these out, and this, this, is, this is that time where we hopefully pull everything together and get some stuff looking good. I thought about it. I stepped back, thought about it, got some blocks together. I also had to go make a, a spruce tree because I ran out of spruce leaves, which uh, I think were, were are quite important for the, the water stuff. You'll see why. But actually, we've got a pretty cool spruce thing. I'm getting distracted. Okay, let me just show you. Uh, right around here, there's a cool little spruce thing. Little floating leaves, kind of like dry, coming down from the, the top down there. Just floating along the river. I really like that. Well, the canal. Even though it's a, a bit of a spectacular canal, it's a canal, nonetheless. So, let's just do one of these here. And already, I hope, let's check it out. Yeah, it's looking a little bit more interesting. I think, I think we can tolerate those blue blocks now. I'm sure, I, I'm sure I had many of you guys worried. Don't worry, I got this. I totally got this. So we'll do that. Maybe we'll keep them at different heights. Something there, something there, like those. And I wasn't actually thinking about doing this much. I didn't I didn't actually consider how much, or not that much, uh, how much trap door I was going to be using. But that's all right. We'll do that, that, that. And uh, maybe maybe these slabs. Yeah, that'll, that'll do. And then a few more here, like there, there, and put them up. There, and now we jump in the water. Okay, yeah, miss our target, and... We'll, we'll be perfect. So, just, just finish it all up. So, once we've got this all done, I think the next stage is getting the stuff around it done. I mean, the, the, the back end of it will be part of the bridge, so we probably will get that done as well, but that, that's gonna be more or less similar to the front. Yeah, look at that. Very, very cool. I, I think, and I, I was having a little hunch that I was going to do this, and I, I want to do this just because it doesn't happen all the time. So I want to go ahead and get some of these, which I never, ever, ever use. I swear, I've, I've only just started using them recently, because I think they're quite a quite an invasive block. What is it? Chiseled, cobbles, chiseled stone? Quite an invasive block. I've, I've been using it on those things there. That is, I think, the first time we used it in this world. All the way up till now, so yeah, it's a pretty big deal. Let's just let's just do that there and do that there. Let's see if this works. I hope it works. Get some get some less used blocks in this world. And what do you know? I think that works. I'm pretty pretty happy with that. So now the next thing that I think maybe we will be able to distract from is getting that underbelly of this thing looking a little bit a little bit different because I don't mind. I don't mind this necessarily, but it's it's definitely not going to be. Ideal. There we go. Oh, one ender pearl left. Man, we've certainly used these today. Uh, something like this, maybe. There. Yeah, something like that. We'll get rid of this. There. So we'll have some leaves just hanging off the edge. By the way, I'm not as short on spruce as I thought I was. There was someone in a chest. So we, sh we should be good to just waste a few of those. There we go, something like that, and maybe a little bit down on this side as well. And we will start getting this thing looking a little bit more built into the into the world. Actually, yeah, I could, uh, I could, yeah, I could probably get away with that. Just, oh, why can't why can't I place that? Or pick block that. There we go. And no, I feel like th is that just out of? I feel like it's just out of reach. Okay, it must be just out of reach. There we go. Let's go check this out, and then we can get rid of... Oh, we've only got one more of these pearls left. How do I get out of here? I don't want to use the pearl just yet. I think I've... Do I really not have a proper way out of here? Because... Oh, I can jump up there. Can I? Jump. There we go. How's that looking? Yeah, that that's, that's definitely doing all right. Maybe putting in a little bit more over here will make it interesting. In fact, what I would like to do is around here, I'm picturing a little bit of a door in there, just to an, an maybe underground area. Who knows, a storage room, something along those lines. I really should not be flying around <laughs> with two and a half hearts, but let's just eat. Let's make sure we don't we don't do something silly. 
Okay, we'll get rid of that junk over there. You see what I mean? We've got some extras. And what I needed was something like that there. And stupid things. Okay, cool. I didn't I didn't hit the side of the wall. That would have been horrible. So let's take a look from the top here. While we've got this, we may as well take advantage of it. Yeah, look at that. That's looking so good. That's actually... I'm actually very happy with that. I think maybe... I might need to do some more convincing, but I'm, I'm pretty sure this over here is going to work out quite well. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, that's going to work out really good. We just need these stairs going up over here, and then, then everything's just going to... It's it's going to turn out so, so good. I hope. It's it's just a matter of time. But I'm, I'm, pretty, I'm pretty confident with this over here. So we'll get rid of this. And then also, because, of course, we do want to finish off the other side... I think that's going to be fairly easy. It's going to be a lot of the same stuff. Where's the sun? Yeah. You know what? I, I, I got this. So I'll get rid of this. Maybe I'll actually... Uh, maybe I'll do this over here. Just to, to make this look like an area that's... That's an actual area. With, uh, with 1.13, those silly boxes around there will be gone. So what I'll do is I'll quickly go and fix up the other side so we can see exactly what this place is meant to look like. And there it is. A beautiful bridge. I really think we need to fix up this area here next because it is looking very, very lonely. So for today, I think we'll go ahead, call that a project well done, finished, completed, whatever you want to say. It is now the next stage that we have to go on to. And I think this is looking very, very cool with these little hanging lights over here. We'll just take a step back and have a look from a little bit further away like that. Yeah, that's looking real good. And then maybe a flyover. Because the flyover is pretty important, you know. A lot of the time, when people look at this world, they end up downloading it and uh, and uh, looking from the top here. So, yeah, that's that's looking in interesting to say the least. Let alone when we add all this stuff in at the background here. In the background here, it's gonna it's just gonna add so much more to it. So for today, thank you very much for joining me, guys. I hope you have enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one.